It was during a recreational dive with a local French Polynesian club that researcher Leticia Hedouin came across a breathtaking rarity. It's just wonderful. And what is very interesting is that the, the reef, like this part of the reef, seems to, to go forever. For as far as the eye can see, stretching across some three kilometers, the divers found vast clusters of rose shaped corals in pristine condition. Sponsored by UNESCO, an expedition was organized to study the untouched area. Unlike most known reefs, which are located in shallow water and are highly vulnerable to climate change and overfishing, this reef is in what scientists call the twilight zone, or an area between 30 and 70 meters deep. Some people who think, oh, well, we found this reef in deep water, so we don't have to worry about coral reefs elsewhere. No, it's, it's going to be subject to some of the same threats, and it's also different. It's lower diversity than the shallow reefs. Coral reefs are an essential living habitat for marine life, and this one is thought to be around 25 years old. Its depth means that it's hard and costly to study, like the vast majority of the Earth's ocean floors. We only have about 20% of the ocean floor, which has been mapped in high resolution. And, and it's, it's amazing when you think that you have better picture of a moon of Mars. And when you realize that this information is really the basis for ocean management, for conservation. Divers believe that the recent volcano in Tonga has not affected the reef, but its discovery is a reminder of the breathtaking wonders that lie below.